Hello, Facebook. It is Goliath here, telling you of a wonderful experience today. We're on the hunt for cosplay. We are on a bus. <laughs> These things that are still used by many people of today. I don't want to get too political, but a certain someone says only poor people use bus. Then guess what? Goliath is very poor, Mr. Rich Snooty person. Today with me we have... Let's see, there she is. There's Lolita. There she is. Very adorable. And we have our photographer and other cosplayer, Yaniel. She's here with our lovely... Off to the big city. Yes, yes. Yes. And you're, and Lolita is knitting as always. Crochet. Get it right. Crochet knitting. It's the same stuff of things. Yeah. No, 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 Goliath. No, no. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so... Right now, we are off to the city to pick up some fabrics for our very secretive cosplay, which we will be holding for Anime Next. Uh, we are unsure of what we will be doing, but it is a very good secret. Well, at least we know the secret. You don't know the secret. That's the fun part. So, it's going to be a, a group theme. There's going to be all five of us. Hopefully, our sixth member will have some free time from school to be joining part of the uh, festivities. But she's very busy with school, so we understand this completely. Um, Lolita, would you like to say anything to our lovely audience? Let's see. As far as the cosplay is concerned, it's going to be very, very intricate, very lovely, and I think everyone's going to really love it as soon as we figure out what we're going to get. <laughs> That's right. So, everybody keep your eyes open. Be sure to watch out for ARC Studios at Anime Next. <laughs> Very enthusiastic that one, you know. She's she's um she's what we call an infant in the world of cosplay. This will be her first con, and and first cosplay. So Yunya, tell us about how you feel. It's very dark in the room now. How do you feel about doing your first con and first cosplay? I'm gonna rock it. The, the elaborate woman, please <laughs> elaborate for us. You're not elaborating. Well, I love costuming. I love dressing up and coming up with the combinations, just making it all come together. So this is gonna be an easy, natural fit. All right. So uh, you you told me before you had many friends that involved in anime, loved anime. Are you secretly an otaku in the closet? It, acknowledge the people. Are you secretly an otaku? My friend, I can't give away all my secrets. <laughs> I have fun with it. I watch my friends have fun with it. I laugh a little bit. <laughs> Always loving it. And, okay, Lolita, well, how long have you been cosplay? How, how many years have you been cosplaying? And how, how much how have you enjoyed yourself doing cosplay? Actually, I've never really thought about how long I've done it. I've always kind of just done it. Um, I think my first first cosplay was like back in high school. And actually, my grandma made me the costume. I still keep it in my closet. Um, but that was like uh, eight years ago, give or take. So I've been doing it fairly regularly since then. Uh, but as far as anime next is concerned, you know, Goliath and I went there last year. We did our little henchmen. Cruella de Vil. Cruella de Vil. Yes. That it was, was awesome. That was lovely. That was awesome. I still have the code. I'm definitely planning on doing Cruella again, but with, you know, better hair. <laughs> okay, listen to people on the internet. I went cheap. I bought that stuff in the front of Party City that's always a dollar. Apparently, don't buy that. It's garbage. It took six cans to turn our hair from this this lovely color to a dingy crap white. If you follow and look in our past history, it was dreadful. It was terrible. I was a cheap jerk and it, it would just did not work. It was, the whole room stunk for the whole three days. Oh, and it, this is a bumpy bus. So back to what you were saying. <laughs> but um, as far as this is concerned, um, Anime Next is going to be held again in Atlantic City and it's in June, so it's going to be super warm and our cosplays are definitely going to be accommodating for that very tastefully. <laughs> so definitely be looking forward for that. And I don't know. There was like a lot of things I wanted to get last year that I didn't really have money for. But now that I have money, I'm going to plan on grading all of it and obviously bargaining to still save some money on the way back home. <laughs> so Anime Next is going to be great. I'm super excited and I'm excited to have everyone, you know, back together again for this con. Yes. All right, so yes, this will be our first video today of Cosplay for the Hunt. We'll, we'll fill you as the day goes along and take photos and pictures as we go through the fabric district to involve with the cosplay. So we'll have another video going up later today when we find some fabrics and maybe as we're running through the cities and causing trouble. Well, I'll be causing the trouble. They'll, they'll be keeping me out of trouble. I'll be causing the trouble. That's the, yes, I, you should all know this by now. 
So, other than that, to our audience, I wish you all the best today. Keep posting, keep following us. Check out our YouTube, our Twitter, Instagram, and many of our other sites. Click on the link below and subscribe. Check out our videos on YouTube. They mostly show her doing things because yeah, apparently the rest of us are lazy. You know, we, we haven't done anything yet. We've talked a big game, but we're getting there. We're building. It took time. We finally have our equipment. The we're finally equipment was expensive. I don't, you other people that have moms and dads that are loaded, I am jealous of you, but I had to earn my equipment. Yes, there's there's one of our bags. We have many other bags with other trinkets and doodads, and yes, Yinyel is having fun. So <laughs> check us out later. We'll keep you posted. Say goodbye to them for now. Bye. Till next time. See you guys later.